Innovation is a probabilistic endeavor. What does that mean? It means that there is no guaranteed tool that will give you a solution. Ross has an incredible reputation, and I've taken some other courses uh, at some other universities, but have just heard rave reviews about the professors and the content, and honestly, just the educational environment, and I found that to be true this week. But I want to be very clear. This program that you've signed up for is designed to equip you not just with a process to develop innovations, but then how to take this back in your organization and lead them. It's going to be very hard, but it's critical you shift from certainty instead to curiosity. So let's roll up our sleeves and begin a simple competition. The Hot Wheels exercise. So they gave us these tracks and they gave us a car and said, which team can take the car furthest down the track? That exercise was great to teach us to just let go of everything we think we know and just try to come up with alternate solutions because there are a lot of things that we don't know. Wednesday morning, we transferred over to uh, the Stamps School of Design. And there, they gave us the assignment of doing some prototyping, which was totally foreign to me. I'd never done anything like that before. But really a great experience, because walking away, it forces you to put yourself in the place of the user. How are they going to interact with this prototype that I'm creating? Ugly is beautiful and smart. So we love ugly prototypes. The idea of an ugly prototype is it's, it's uh, super efficient, right? We're looking at that delta between effort in and what it's able to answer. So these things should be ugly, and that's a good thing. Our ideas, while they might be innovative and great, can't just live on their own. They need to take hold. They need to be contagious. Marcus Collins came on board to teach us about cultural contagion. Is there something more compelling, more powerful, than going viral. You've seen a lot of things and be like, ha, that's funny, and keep it moving, right? Well, it means that just because something goes viral, it doesn't necessarily mean that people move. I would say to anyone that's looking to jumpstart and inform the way that they think about innovation, um, I could not recommend to you better leaders, better teachers, better content. If you're considering taking this class and you're on the fence, you're not quite sure if you're going to get anything out of it, I would strongly suggest that you take it. You're going to learn a lot about yourself and you'll also learn a lot about actually your internal capabilities that you already have. It will just help you rethink and relook at the way that you approach your job.